Hey. Wake up. Blood Moon. Blood Moon. What do you want? Has it begun to set in yet, at least, for you? What happened? <laughs> on. Hey. Hello. What do you want? I want to talk for a little bit. Oh, the man wants to talk. What is stopping you? Nothing's stopping me. I want to ask you some questions. Are you going to answer them at all, or are you just going to uh, sit there? Of course, and... you wish for answers. Why? Because it's my first question is just why. Why what? Why did you decide to go along and just turn your back on us? <laughs> Is that your only question? Really? No, it's not my only question. <laughs> Let's go back a little bit to when you decided that it was time to turn on me after you beat up Stitch Wraith. Why would you, the one who had the bomb in his head, probably still does, just deactivated somehow, some way, why would you go along with the plan knowing any step you took would probably result in your own death? What reason did you reasonably have to take that choice Oh my god. You're just like the rest of those blabbering fools. Yeah, probably. Could answer the question though if you really wanted to. We I mean never wanted your help. We never did. It wasn't about help, was it? We never sought it. We never wanted it. But you and your oh please allow us to help goody two shoes act of yours. Now I didn't ask you if you wanted to help. What I did was I gave you a command and I put a bomb well, I didn't put the bomb in your head, Monty did. And you decided to throw that away. Throw the choice away of of, of working with people who would throw you in the right direction. But you threw it away. <laughs> Why? Because Why? we hate you. you. You still probably do. We do, yes. But you hate someone a lot more than me right now, don't you? We'll get him eventually. He's dead. <laughs> you really are irredeemable, aren't you? We are you really just gonna sit always. there? Always. Said we were not redeemable and we don't care to be redeemed because you were made that way. Oh, what point does being made that way of an excuse at that point? This point, I was made to be a killer. Here's the trick, buddy. We enjoyed it. Yeah, and an attitude like that got your brother killed, didn't it? And now you're sitting here alone. His actions affect you more than they affect him because he's gone and you're stuck in that goddamn cell by yourself, alone. No one to talk to. No we. Just you in a cell. Oh, we. And he was ready to throw your life away. But that doesn't matter because you just don't care. That's fine. My brother knows my abilities. And your brother also knows that you would be dead. Or he knew that if the bomb worked. We both agreed to it, you idiot. You trying to get me to hate my own brother? No, I'm, not like I'm actually moon. here to try and see what you're actually all about. But all I can see now that you're just gonna be a little bit insane. So what I'm gonna do, Blood Moon, is I'm gonna walk out of this room and eventually, Monty will come back down here, and he'll use that machine up there to put the bomb in your head and set it back right, and then we're gonna set it off. And that'll be it. I wanted to see just once what you were good at. Maybe see if I could channel that energy into something that was worth my time. Our time. Do whatever you time. want. Good. Oh, and, uh... No. It's alright. Well, 
will find him. And I'll finish the job. I always tend to do that. I'll finish it, brother, when we both started. Alright, time to figure out if I'm killing this one or moving on or so something. What are you doing? What am I doing? Oh, let's see. The very wonderful entertainment that I have here. Like looking at a wall or the vents. Huh? Alright, look. Lemon, I'm gonna give you two choices now. You're actually more confined and had more time to think about it. But when I get out, you are going to die. Alright. That's a choice. You sure want to make that choice? Why haven't you killed me yet? <sighs> also, a pretty good question. Why haven't I killed you yet? See, here's a deal. In this stupid pizza plex, there's so much that goes on here. Foxy gets kidnapped by God knows what. Stitch Wraith showed up out of nowhere. Eclipse made an appearance. Ruin showed up. And now here there's like other monsters just roaming around. So, I'm trying to decide if keeping you alive to deal with them is justifiable enough. Or if I should just kill you and get it out of the way. Cause maybe I can make a different blood moon. Or just something else that can protect us better. Then again, I do have Jack in my payroll now. Or maybe not my payroll, but... Trust, I guess. If you wanted me dead, you would have done it already. You know I'm more special, don't you? Well, yeah, maybe not. Maybe not everybody has your combat abilities, I guess. Or is as bloodthirsty as you. But, I mean, I can't make a program like that. You can't do it, can you? Can't do what? Make you again? I mean, yeah, technically. Couldn't. I need to find another little red man, but... You... Listen... To me... When my brother was at your foot... You could have saved him... But no... You made it nice and slow and watched him wither away... I... I'm pretty sure I actually very quickly ended his... Ended his life... Why... Not do the same to me... You're pulling something, aren't you? A bluff, is it? <sighs> Maybe. I guess I'm still trying to figure out if I should get rid of you or not. To be very honest, I am very close to doing that. Taco Puppet. Foxy. Earth a little. A little bit of the sun. And they all tell me very different things. About how you should die. And about how you should, uh... Get a chance, but... Given your track record of things, I don't think you want a second chance. Hell, you didn't want, you didn't want the first one. So right now... I'm stuck. How would the great gator kill me? Uh, fill this place with flames? Destroy my body piece by piece? I was just thinking about deactivating you and reusing you for scrap. Can't do that. You're stuck in there. Or, I give you a chance. Again. Let's re I don't want a chance! We never wanted it! You know, the other one ain't in your head. To give yourself a pat on the back or a yes, man. I'm just saying, you come to your own decisions. Foxy sure as hell did. I do. So does Sun and Moon. Puppet too. Maybe your brother was- Don't you dare mock my brother! Then you. What you were. You were a... Are... A... Horrible... Individual. Unremorseful. Unthankful. Unwanting. And undeserving. So which is it, Blood Moon? Do you want to live or do you want to die? <sighs> which is it? We will choose. There is no we, unless you change your pronouns to they them. But you know, I don't. I don't think you have. All of a sudden, 
choose to live. Wow. Okay, kind of surprising. I need you to get on the a little uh, chair back there. So you can put a bob in my head. Yep, exactly what I'm doing. You're gonna get back on that chair. Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. When we get the... Okay, I get it. You're gonna kill me or something, right? I've heard so many threats at this point. I, I really just don't care. Get the f*** on the damn table. Sorry, editor. Oof. Second, then I'm gonna need to try to find Frank. I have no idea where that guy is. Frank. We will find him. Guess. Try to. No one's been able to find him since the events, I guess. Might have just disappeared. Or died. Or, you know, found a to find a place himself. <sighs> there. Bomb has been planted in your head. This time, it should work because Frank doesn't have anything to separate, I hope, unless you got a third personality in there. I do not. It was just me and my brother. Well, whatever. I'll be repairing you soon, ish, when I feel like it. I'll be telling Puppet and Foxy what you chose. In the meantime, I'm gonna get out of here. You can get up and just continue staring at the vents or whatever the hell you were doing beforehand. When you find Frank, you, I'm not telling him to come down here. Frank can do that if he wants. Uh, uh, I need to think. I need to think. How do I kill the gator? How do I kill Foxy? I'm not just killing them. I'm going to tear down this whole place piece by piece. They will never know peace until I, David, so... I'm going to break everything. <sighs> what was that? <sighs> Who are you? Open the door! Woof. Open the door! Where Woof. did that dog go? Woof. Bark. Uh, stupid dog. <laughs> stupid dog. <gasps> Where did he... Where'd he go? What are you? Vegeta. Where'd the dog go? Is he in here? <sighs> Here, boy. I don't want to go back here. to Antarctica. Please? I don't want to go back to the penguins. Open the door. Why? The dog's in here. No, he's not. You're dangerous. I can see he's not in there, actually. How do you know we're dangerous? Dad told me. I could probably take you if I trained for the next couple years. Cut my mantle as Prince Who of All Sands. You're dead. Oh. Hmm. What's Monty? <sighs> oh, uh, you must be Blood Moon. We're kind of like brothers, actually. Brothers? Kinda. I only had one brother. Well, no, because Monty made you. So if Dad made you, then he made me. That means we're brothers. That thing is not my creator. But he is, kind of, a little bit. No, right? he is not. What is he then? A stepping stone. Okay, that's a weird, that's a weird way of saying it. Where's that dog? Where'd he go? Oh, Up I there? killed it. No, you didn't. I didn't. It's little no. dance it did annoyed me enough and I slaughtered it. No, the dog can't open that door, so I'm assuming you just didn't kill it. See? Logic! I'm learning! So, any me, mighty, uh, no. catch a blood moon by the toe. If he hollers, don't let him go. Is this your whole thing? Is it go. being this stupid? Any me, mighty, uh, Oprah's hands not in there right now. See you around, dude. Ah, uh, you 
suck. This whole place sucks. Vegeta is Monty's son, no. I know my next couple targets. I need to get this ball out of my head. I need to get everything out of my head. I need something. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, didn't think, but... Yo. Where are you going? Not there. What'd you do, Foxy? I walked in there to check on the construction and I knocked over some stuff and they're mad. Hey, Fox, if I walk in there right now, the stuff's like all over the floor. <laughs> yeah, it is. Mm. So, uh... How's Blood Moon? What? What? How's Blood Moon? Uh, surprisingly decided to take the whole living, my idea. Oh, surprising. People wish to live over dying. Are we sure he's not going to just try to plot behind our backs to get back at us for some yeah. reason? Well, yeah, pr probably, probably is. Not going to lie. Mm -hmm. The thing well, is, this bomb in his head should definitely work this time because he's not going to be pulled in half or whatever the hell Frank did. But speaking of Frank, by the way, have you seen him? That's, figure that's figurative. That's that's a turn of phrase. Nothing. Gotta be careful about that kind of stuff. Yeah, not seen Frank anywhere actually. Anyway, my social security number is six five nine two two eight seven three two. Isn't there, isn't there four digits for the last part? Yep. So what's the last? What's the last one? Uh, just curious. Zero. Hmm. Okay. I mean, it's also it's three two four by the way. So I already, already gave you the digit. Whatever. So, um, what the hell do you think Frank actually is? That whole speech he gave me, all fears laid bare, everything will be laid bare, something about fear, fear, it's always about fear with him, everyone's kind of freaked out, scared of him. Dude, I don't know, have you seen Frank at all since any of this stuff happened? No. He Puppet. showed up, separated Blood Moon, and cameras caught him talking to Stitch Wraith to send him to me. Puppet hasn't seen Frank either, no. Puppet did mention something weird, though. What? You know how Golden Freddy watches her, everybody? Some, some crap like that, yeah. He can't see Frank. Well. Puppet let me know that after what happened recently, which kind of changes things. So if Golden Freddy, the supposed keeper of magic, the guy that watches over everybody and gives tries to guide people and stuff like that, who been oddly... Absent from our whole ordeal here, by the way, but besides that point, he can't even see the guy. He had no idea Frank was near Francine or Freddy or us at all. He was like, I don't know who they're talking to, talking to somebody. Maybe he thought we had schizophrenia. I don't know, but he didn't see him. That's not possible. No Frank was actually supposed to replace Moon or Son for the daycare, I think. So he's from Fazbear? I, I don't know. That's what, though, that's what, that's what Frank came from. Look, I mean, I guess I never looked at the records, but are that's we, what are I was we told. sure it wasn't tampered with the machine that he's what if he's just inhabiting that machine? Dude, I do not know. I I don't know either. What the hell is he? He creeps me out. He's supposed to replace Moon. He's never given me any kind of daycare attendant vibes ever. Yep. Actually. He just gives me uh creepy vibes. I will stare I will be in your dreams later tonight vibes. Scary vibes. Like that pit in your stomach. When you see him originally type thing. I thought it yep. was just me being like nervous about my date with Mango when I first saw him. You know, I was like, ah, it's just whatever, it's just date nerves. But then it kind of just keeps happening. But not really. And most recently it was very apparent that I was just kind of worried about that guy being there. I usually am not scared of Frank anymore, right? But I was confused. Nervous about it. Right. Look, I gotta get FC. I'll look into Frank if I can. He he usually comes to me if at some point, you right? Can man, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if you can't. I yeah, I I looked around everywhere. I mean, I don't know what he's what his whole deal is, but I gotta figure that out. Have you made any progress on that core, by the way? Barely. I had to be dealing with Bloodman for a bit. And some other stuff came up, but uh, what's the odds that at some point the creator reaches out to us about it? Yeah, well, that Pretty. thing is not anywhere where you're going to find it. Mm -hmm. I have a bunch more places than just that one I've showed you. Okay. Okay. Well, the point is, we have to look out for that because he'll probably know at some point. 
What happens? Maybe. Yeah, probably. I wouldn't be surprised. That was his creation. Secondly, also, let Earth know that her dad killed kids. Thanks. That, that'd be pretty great. I don't know how to just bring that topic up in conversation. Hey, Earth, having a good day? Yeah, your dad killed kids, by the way. Have a just good day. bring up... I think she knows that they're like siblings, right? A little bit. Who? Is it Trace and her? You're not suggesting what I think you're suggesting, right? Just kind of be like, hey, Earth, Stitchrath got beaten by Blood Moon, killed. Saving FC also turns out he's a dead kid. I'll be honest, man. I don't think she'll care about Stitchrath dying. But she might care about the kids. Yeah, probably. She should know about that. Hey! Dude. You know the amount of kids that we disappear on a yearly basis at this place, right? Oh yeah, it happens a lot. Right? 20 million. That is that's not... A bit, that that's, is a bit not that is, that's a bit faulty. That's a bit that's faulty. A we, are, we are going to depopulate the entire American just population. That at, is at not that possible. Stop. Don't... Two. You're listening. 20. Either way. 200. 2,000. I keep saying two. 20,000. 200,000. And two. It's These bots are stupid, man. They're, they're very stupid. So, whatever. Yeah, Breeder killed two kids. I'm assuming it's two. I mean, the one acted childish when he took control of the body, ran away from Blood Moon saying it wasn't fair, he didn't have control of the body yet, didn't know how to use it. I didn't know how to use it properly, which, thank God. Thank God, because that one gave me the heebie-jeebies, Monty. I, mean, I think, in general, the, the whole thing gave me heebie-jeebies. At one, at one point, he stopped the one from killing me. Did he do that to, like, make us think he was nice? Like, it's weird, man. Heebie-jeebies, just the weird... Ugh. I don't know. I don't know if it matters either. <sighs> I just can't shake the feeling of just eyes on me. There's nothing here. Yeah. I'm gonna get FC. They have not replaced that. It's kind of funny. It's think been about there it. for all for spin there forever. Yep. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get FC from daycare. I'll look into Frank if I can. I'll ask Puppet while I'm there if I can. We'll see. I'll be surprised if you find out anything, man. Either either Puppet's there right now or they're in the cringe dimension doing their job over there instead. I don't know which one it is. Suppose. I'm gonna go to my green room. You do that. Have a good yep. one. Hey, yo. What's up? Where's Sun at? Uh, he is currently out getting candy. I stole all the candy. Who's watching you right now? The computer. Does it work? It hasn't worked twice now when I've been here. There are only two voice actors. Right. I'm just wondering if... What did you just... What do you... Alright, kid. Look, we gotta get going. Back to the house. Please do not make Sun mad again. Actually, you know what? Do it. It's funny. Here, I'll help. Just that there. But I was trying to do it differently. Oh. How? Show me. Oh. It is a ch... <sighs> Where'd you learn that word? Internet. Who? Where? When? What computer? What tablet? What phone? Your tablet. God damn it. How'd you get my password? It is Did you easy. hide my blind spot? I like I love Mango 44. <laughs> you use the same password for everything. Can I change it now? Can I change it to I love Mango 87? That'll work. Come on, kid. Let's get out of here. Uh, so, um, how you doing, by the way? I'm doing okay. Everything is better now. Is it? Yes. You think so? I think so, too. I think so, too. Come on. Uh, what do you think about what happened? I am happy the Blood Moon is gone. Well, one half of them is still around. Just in a parts and service. It is? Yeah, he accepted... The deal Monty gave him, and uh, well, I don't totally agree with it. I don't also think we should. I don't know. He's still around, but there's a bomb back in his head, so oh. be careful with that. Uh, but yeah. Okay. He seemed pretty broken up when that half of the Citrus got a uh, when he disappeared, when he 
went away. Stitch Wraith helps make me. Yeah, he was there a long time. Did you... What were they like, that side, when they weren't being complete, well, mean people to me? They were okay. Took me to Mario Land. What? Is that a place you can go? Where's that at? Took me in Mario Land in Sim... Simulation? Sim yes. Okay. I have to ask Monty about that. Was it like a... Which location? Was it like a certain game of Mario? A beach. Probably Sunshine. All right. Um, okay. Uh, I can look into that at some point for you. Um... And the other side, the the the, the nice side, the, the quote unquote nice it side. Wasn't I, nice. I, I I realize that now. I realize that it wasn't nice now. Um. So, what actually happened between when I left you, or you left me, and you getting back that made that change? I don't know what you mean. Why well, did that one seemed like it was always nice it, it it didn't try to kill me when i questioned it in parts and service that one time it actually stopped the one side from the mean side that oh i don't know what i'm asking you kid it's no big deal as long as you're okay that's what matters right so you're here hello how was how was daycare today it was good fun good i like daycare you didn't hurt any kids today right no Good. All right. I threatened to break one's legs, though. Bruh. Why? They had this weird face. That's not a valid reason to do that. Getting into Blood Moon territory. You realize that, right? Well, they looked at me funny. What do you mean by that? They looked at me like... Oh, like that? Okay. Um, I mean, that's not a valid reason to, to, to hurt somebody or threaten somebody. At all? And then I leaked their address. To who? Everyone in daycare. How'd you get their address? It is on a computer. And did Sun know you did that? No. Do you want Sun to know you did that? No. Do you want me to know that? So you just told me. Buddy. Buddy, 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 buddy. I'm not going to tell Sun, but you have to promise me one thing, okay? Yes. I'm not going to do that ever again, because it's mean. And wrong, actually. Uh, fine. Look, there's places and times you can get your frustrations and your activity out. Daycare against humans is not the place for it. But he also said he doesn't like Foxy. Valid. You know what? It's all valid now. No, for real though, we'll go to fencing. Or someplace, or we'll go like on a hike, or okay. we'll take karate lessons, or something. We don't have to worry about the these. But I know karate. What? I know karate. You do? Yes. Show hey. me. Ah. Oh. Wow. Okay. Yep. <clears throat> Are you okay? Please just don't do that again. Thanks. I wasn't ready for it this time. Uh, I'll have to train that oh. to ask Monty for lessons or something or an upgrade. Jesus, you're going to outgrow me. All right. Um, so you hungry? I would like macaroni and cheese. Let's go to Kmart. We'll get some mac and cheese and maybe some Little Caesars as well while we're there. Okay. Cool.